So this is my first time doing a vlog. I've done a lot of stuff on video before, but not like this. And I feel a little bit nervous and weird, but I think it's gonna be good. So it's been a pretty productive morning so far. I got up at 4.30 and wrote about 1,200 words. Did a workout, took a shower. I sent out a newsletter, did a little bit of scheduling, and so now I'm gonna go drop off the boys' lunch and go to a coffee shop. The newsletter was for Family on Purpose. The Tale of the Missing Lego. It's gonna be a good one. My workspace is a little bit of a mess. Why? Why is there... I guess I'm gonna have to put the oh, camera down to do that one. But she finally gave up and lay still, weeping. I can't find her, she cried. Her hand went to her throat. Her fingers fumbled for the locket, thinking I saw Helen's pale form. He's so messy. Hovering under a nearby willow tree. To my relief, she seemed to have lost her strength, her will to fight me. Faintly, I could hear Helen cry. I guided her through the door, stepping carefully on the floorboards. Maybe we can find matches here, light a fire or something. Sometimes, we were perfectly. Love, 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 love. tickets. I mean, parking vouchers, not tickets. I pay for my parking. Almost there. Alright, I'm here at Local Coffee. Uh, I haven't been here in a while, so it'll be nice to hang out. I really love the vibe in this place. That was actually really cool. I'm glad I came out to local coffee today. I ran into a guy who runs a fitness shop and they're trying to open up some new locations in town and I got his business card. And then I also ran into a guy who saw my setup and is thinking about getting into vlogging. We got to talk for a few minutes and I got some good work done. So I call that a win. Back home, I gotta be quiet though because the twins are down for a nap. Most days, Rachel leaves me some lunch. 
What do we got here? That looks delicious. I got some good work done today. Um, I didn't finish everything on my to-do list, but it's about 10 minutes until the boys get home from school, and then we're going to art lessons, and then I've got to cook dinner, and then the whole nighttime routine. So it's about to get crazy. So I wanted to tell you why I went out today. I've got a really nice setup at home, uh, fast computer, fast internet, really good coffee. And there aren't a lot of reasons for me to leave. I can usually get everything done that I need to here unless I've got a meeting with somebody. But I, I like to go out every once in a while and here's why. One, I'm an extrovert and so I love being around other people. It gives me a lot of energy. Not everybody uh, is that way. Some people could stay in their house for a really long time and never leave and they'd be perfectly fine. But I might go a little bit crazy. Secondly, the, one of the most important reasons for me right now, at this stage in my business, um, really early on, you know, doing traditional marketing doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Doing content marketing, um, it's good, but it's not going to get me business right away. The only way I'm really going to make a difference in my business right now is networking with people and meeting with people face to face and having those one-on-one -on -one interactions. And so when you go out, that's more likely to happen. And that's actually what did happen today. Like I said earlier, I met a, a few guys and got to have some good conversations. And who knows what that'll lead to, or who knows um, how that might connect me with other people that I didn't know. So anyways, uh, that was my experience. And I just share that with you as an encouragement. Maybe you are content just staying at home where you are and not getting out. but. It might be worth your while every once in a while to get out and uh, get into a different environment and see what happens. Okay, go ahead. What Veterans Day means to me. It means to me that veterans are very important because some of them fought in the army, some of them protected the skies, and some even protected the shoreline or the water. Some protected the land. Veterans also helped us have freedom. They made ultimate sacrifices to protect us. That's why we think veterans are very important.